evening. Here are some of the headlines to anticipate against tomorrow, 21st of February, 2024. This is tomorrow's news today. We begin with national news. No Igbo group would join protest against Tinubu's government, says ONZ. Customs begin distribution of seized food items to Nigerians. Installation of e-gates in airports will be completed soon, says Tunji Ojo. State police bill passes second reading at the House of Representatives. Shokoto State has over 32 food smuggling routes, says Shetima. Federal government is investigating 22.7 trillion naira ways and means loan and report is to be released soon, says Wale Edum. It is very embarrassing. Federal government warns MDAs against leaking sensitive documents. Take alternative routes, Nema Oji's resident of Lagos community that complained about flooding this morning. Federal Capital Territory Authority seals Abuja orphanage for trafficking over 23 children. Troops arrest high-profile kidnapper in Kano State. Nine killed and seven injured in Lagos Abelkuta Road accident. We move to business news. CBN and the Office of National Security Advisor partner to probe and penalize those involved in forex racketeering. Representative panel queries four banks over 11.63 trillion naira revenue collected via remitter. Consumers are no longer able to afford bottle of beer. Nigerian beauty CEO speaks on forex crisis. And in technology news, Spotify's complaints sparks European Union's 538 million dollar fine on apple music we move to entertainment news court orders moja kunya kano state tiktoker to undergo mental evaluation the video gift offers 300 million naira months after 487 million naira donations and in international news Accountant General of the Federation cautions ECOWAS court against unforeseeable judgment. Guinea Junta dissolves government months to democratic transition. British Nigerian doctor has been accused of having sex with a vulnerable patient. And lastly, in sports. 2025 AFCON will be played around July-August in Morocco, says the Confederation of African Football. Ivory Coast confirmed Cup of Nations winner Faye as permanent coach. Get the details of this news and more on our website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspapers from your closest newsstands. Do not forget to follow us on social media at Guardian Nigeria across our social media pages. I am Lois Oguni. Good night.